Let's talk about the MDCAT 2021. So what's new in terms of paper pattern, the time allotted and much more. So we will compare the MDCAT 2021 with the MDCAT 2020 and see what's new. So for the 2020 version, there were four sections, Biochemistry, Physics, English. However, now there are five sections, Biochemistry, Physics, English and Logical Reasoning being the new one. The way that the questions were divided initially were 80 MCQs for Bio, 60 for Chem, 40 for Physics and 20 for English. However, now there are 68 MCQs for Bio, 56 for Chemistry, 56 for Physics, 20 for English and 10 for MCQs. I'm not a huge fan of this division of questions as I believe that medical is a field intensely focused on Bio and some of Chemistry. Thus, reducing the number of MCQs for Bio and increasing them for in Physics does not really make sense to me. Let's see how that goes though. So the total number of MCQs for the 2020 version were basically 200 MCQs. And for the 2021 version, they are 210 MCQs because of the logical reasoning. Now let's move on and let's talk about the time duration. So initially there were 150 minutes, uh, which is two and a half hours. However, now you get to 10 minutes, which is three and a half hours. So with a increase of 10 MCQs, we just got a bump of 60 minutes, which is huge and does not make a lot of sense. But then again, let's see. The minimum passing marks initially were 60% or 120 marks. And now they are 65%, which is 136.5 marks, which you can bump up to 137. Now let's move on and let's talk about the mode of examination, which was particularly the new one. So in 2020, it was paper based, but now it is going to be computer based. Now I have a lot of skepticism on this one because, well, in the 2020, the, when the Corona situation was going up, that is when there was a really need for a computer based system. However, now it does not make sense when the COVID situation has become much better. And apart from that, I feel like to me, Paper-based comes much more naturally than computer-based. So then again, let's see how this goes. Talking about the examination fee, well, the MDCAT 2020, there was it was only PK of 1500, but now it is PK of 6000, which I do not appreciate at all. Because for people who are applying to public medical universities or cannot afford to even go to a private university, how can they afford such a huge amount for just an entry examination? I think this is absolutely... Um, this is this is basically ignorance what else on the behalf of pmc okay so now let's talk about the negative marking so none in 2020 version none even right now so that's good and the result weight is another good thing because in 2020 you had to wait a few weeks one to two but now you will get your results within 30 minutes of completion so that is after 30 minutes the results will be sent to you by email and also to all the institutions that you plan on applying to so that's two of the good things that still happen or still remain or have been added so best of luck to everyone who's applying all right, so there's one more important thing that needs to be discussed, and uh, that is basically about the MDCAT 2021. Ke PMC ke according, ye expected dates of examination is from 30th August to 30th September 2021. So there will be 31 days. Chin mein aap kabhi bhi apna exam le sakte hain. There will be two slots per day. Now there's a lot of uncertainty of how they will implement this because kya wo 62 different versions banayenge of the MDK 2021 to ensure ke jo jin bachcho ka pehle exam ho jata hai, wo apne dosto ko baad mein paper leak nahi karenge ya unko nahi batayenge ke hume kya questions aaye, kya concepts aaye. So that's a big question. And secondly, what's the cyber security? Aap ek computer based system की तरफ तो जा रहे हैं, but क्या आपके पास वो facilities हैं, क्या आपका software system इतना strong है कि you will ensure कि there will be no hacking, that there will be you know you will आपका जो content है, जो बच्चों की data है, क्या आप उसको safeguard कर सकेंगे, right? So this is a big question. Paper leak तो नहीं हो जाएगा, hack तो नहीं हो जाएगा, and then there are a lot of things that can go wrong आपके इस computer based examination में. So keeping in mind कि वो paper based किस ना लेते हैं, I have a lot of questions for this computer based one and I'm not sure ke ye kis se implement hoga. Inshallah Allah kare ke acha ho jai, but I have some serious doubts on this so yeah aapki expected dates hain aap kabhi bhi isko le sakte hain PMC kis se isko administer karti hai that is their 
uh, job although i've I, you know i don't have my hopes uh, very high but let's see uh, apart from that is ke ilawa important baat ye ke agar aapko ye pareshani ki you're not familiar with the computer based system well they did say ke they will provide you with one practice examination and with the option to take many more now then again har banda Uh, इतना फेमिलियर नहीं होता ठीक है गैजेट्स हमारे हाथ में हैं फ़ोन है बट हर बंदा जो है वो इतना फेमिलियर भी नहीं होता कंप्यूटर बेस्ड सिस्टम के साथ सो देन अगेन आई एम नॉट श्योर अबाउट हाउ दिस विल बी डन बट देन अगेन लेट्स यू नो लेट्स बी होपफुल अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट फिफ्टीन जुलाई इज द डेड लाइन टू अपलाई फॉर दी एम डी सो इसको अपने दिमाग में रखिएगा अगर आप अप्लाई करना चाहते हैं दिस इज़ द टाइम डू नॉट वेट एन अप्लाई If you like the video then give it a big thumbs up subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon in case ke hum koi bhi future videos lagate hain wo aap tak pahunchti rahe and apart from that and i'm pretty sure ke aap sab jo hai jab mehnat karenge to aap sab jahan pahunchna chahte hain aap zarur pahunchenge so good luck for that take care khuda hafiz